Hello and welcome back to Gran Turismo 7. Thank you very much for joining me in today's video. Now, today I'm going to be doing some racing at, well, Blooming Speedway, Willow Springs International Raceway, and Daytona International Speedway, trying to get Camaro. So, last time we were chasing Mustangs, or collecting Mustangs. This time we are collecting Camaros. However, I'm going to be doing this in a Mustang. Now, I have... It does say it looks like we're looking for about 600 uh, performance points. So that is what I am I am pushing forward. So 600 performance points is what I'm looking for. I've got 611 on the Mustang now. I've done some work on it. I've spent 70k again on the car. But hopefully this helps. So make sure you stay tuned. We're going to get these three races done. Get the Camaros and then see where we need to go from there. I have no idea how many of these menu books there are. Um, Tebo Toast did mention it to me and I've forgotten. Was it 28? Something like that. So I'm, I'm some way through, but uh, I still have some ways to go. Make sure you stay tuned. Right, three laps on the infield section of this track. Interesting. Okay, let's see what I can do here. Um, I have not driven this track, of course, before, and I think I've made one massive mistake with my car, and that is that I have put a low-end supercharger on it when I probably should have put a high-end supercharger on it. Yep, I have made a massive mistake. At the very least, perhaps I should put racing tires on this. If this doesn't work, if I'm unable to put my power down, I will be putting racing tires on this. Seriously? Teslas? Yeah, I'm spinning up my wheels I am here. That was a, a stupid move. Uh, you, you can actually hear me spinning up my wheels. Still on lap one. This is where I should be able to start putting some power in. That wasn't terrible, although I'm still in sixth place. But I do have a few laps to do this in. Whoa. Okay. That was a bit rude. Wasn't even my fault this time. What's that blue car up, up front? Not the Mark 1 I can see in the distance. The one in front of this yellow one. Is that a Corvette? A Camaro, I mean. Is this a Camaro? It looks lovely. Sorry. 2016 Camaro. Yeah, not not having traction control on this and and having a supercharger, I've I've really sort of set myself up for failure here. Um, but that being said, the car's doing okay-ish. Wow. It's just that I think I need. keep it in fifth there's only five gears on a car like this you would expect a sixth gear had to be quite careful there I was kind of concerned that I was going to mess up I could have just stayed on the lower side of this right I think I've 
I think if I just stay behind this car, if I stay behind this Camaro that's in front of me, I should be able to handle it. Come on, careful. Oh dear. Braking performance on this car, not the greatest. I say braking performance not the greatest, I think the issue is, honestly, if I run that Camaro out of room, yep, I was well within my rights to do that. Wheel spin. Uh, I think I think the issue is not really braking performance, I think the, the issue is just uh, not enough grip on the tyres flat out. But that is a win for me, and actually not the easiest of wins. There we go. Right, um, note to self, or note to anybody playing this, who, you should all probably know this anyway, because I this was just me being really stupid about it. But um, what you should be doing is you should, on a car like this, a muscle car, you want to put a high performance, uh, sorry, a high end supercharger, not a low end. Because you already have the power low end, the torque, I mean. ZL, ZL1, is this not what Jay's Two Cents has? He has one of these, doesn't he? I have no idea. And if you don't know who Jay's Two Cents is, go check out Jay's Two Cents online. Computing stuff, amazing, and he, and he knows his cars. Um, actually, I've got an idea. I, I've seen where I want the picture, and it's going to be at the end. How do I... I would like, again, the, the option to skip, to choose where I want to be on this. That would be brilliant. Right, and there. There will do. Because I think I've got, yep, that's, it's just the colour of the car. At that angle, the colour of the car looks spectacularly good and that is all I wanted um, again no 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 uh, where is it condition settings and uh, no scratches please and no cracked headlights let's get a focus there bring that aperture down um, I think if I just move the camera about there, that is looking really nice now. And let's bump the aperture up a little bit. And try and take that and see if that gives me what I'm, what I'm after. Maybe the angle's slightly wrong. In terms of how much I should have tilted it. But no, actually that... No, that, that does work for me. It isn't quite what I was after but it, it is close enough and I think again it's the glare that um, lets it down but otherwise that that is that is the photo I wanted okay let's not waste any time let's get on with the let's get on with the next one so out of this I go um, next is Willow Springs oh boy Willow Springs low end supercharger this is going to be interesting. This is going to be very interesting. But it's in the daytime, not at sunset like before. You can even hear the... Um, you, you can hear the struggles with... You can hear the struggles of the computer, the AI trying to do this. Which is interesting. Right, gentle. Gentle. Just just as gentle as you can be. Ooh, understeer, understeer. Uh, yep, it's understeer. It's fine, it's fine. I can see a number of cars 
up ahead that I will be overtaking at a moment's notice. I say that as I struggle to put the power down once again. What is that car? Is that a Dodge? This car right next to me, is that a Dodge? Or is that a... You no, know, it's a Shelby. It looked a bit sh really strange on the back. Just got to stay on this inside, that's the problem. There we go. Okay. Three laps here, so we should be okay. Third place is definitely easily done. Slight locking on the wheels. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dangerous, Kamara. Dangerous. Let's try not to mess up this corner this time. Little bits better. Whoa. Car just wanted to snap out on me there and then did a little bit there. It didn't really snap out. That was more like it just wallowy. And that's because I was just. I carried too much speed and then could not scrub it off fast enough. Over the bumps, got to be a little bit careful as demonstrated right there. Now let's really put the power down and try and catch up to catch up to these guys as best as possible well I say as best as possible right well apparently I'm doing this which is not a good thing all right and let's start all over again Yep, this car is not easy to drive. I think what I've done is I've I've created... No, I don't know what I've created. I've created something that's pretty horrific, though. Help if it would go into gear. That's the other thing. It's fine. Third third place on, on this one will do if it, if, if it needs to be. Um, I could have won. I, I, I think I, I could have. Because, I mean, look at me catching up to these guys. It's it's clear that I have the pace to win. I just do not have the skill to win. Although, that being said... Could I... No way as this is going to... I'm thinking of really pushing it and... I think if I do what I'm thinking, I may end up regretting it. So I perhaps I should not do what I'm thinking, even though I'm literally doing what I'm thinking. Oh, yep, yeah, almost ended up regretting that. I'm trying to get second here, by the way. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I could have got first. I could have got first. Sorry, a, a DMC DeLorean just won. That's not possible. But... Did I just get beaten by a DeLorean? I just got beaten by a DeLorean. No, I'm not having that. I'm not having that. I, I need to do this again. I cannot be beaten by a DeLorean. That thing has a top speed of 88 miles per hour. Right, that's just... Okay. Yep. Perhaps, perhaps the title of this video will be Beaten by a DeLorean. Fourth. And this time, let's try not to miss gears and try not to get caught up behind this. No, nope, same thing's happened as last time. Got caught up behind the Plymouth.
but now that I know how to drive this track a little bit better with this car in its current configuration as you can see more speed and that's the one thing about Gran Turismo as well and another thing apart from the the racing and the fact that you know you push for the racing um, you have to try lots of different cars and because of that you, you tend to not really unlike a Seto Corsa which I, I do need to play some more of you tend to not well, come on where are you guys going you tend to not get used to a single car what are you doing Shelby and that does make it a little bit harder in a sense to to play the title because you, you're swapping between cars so often that at least at the start it, it isn't easy to to work with a, a single car right so I can see two cars ahead of me. I need to dispatch of this Mark 1, which I'm about to write now. There we go. Now, all I've got to do is get around this. Now, I wonder if Daytona is going to be... Um, I wonder if the Daytona one is going to be the infield or just the outer loop. Also, I'm really interested in seeing what HDR is like with this. Obviously, I'm playing without HDR. I think HDR would look sublime. Whoa. Come on, keep, keep a hold of your vehicle. Keep a hold of your vehicle. Because I'm not doing this again. Nice and slow. Well, I say nice and slow, nice and gentle. That's it. Ease it through the corner. Ease it through. And now floor it. Leaving it in fifth. So this gives me an entire lap to catch up to these guys. Which I've already now caught up to them. That DeLorean is still out in front. I do not want to be beaten by a DeLorean. Although I do think I know what the episode title will be then. Because obviously I have already been beaten by a DeLorean. So I'm going to have to go back and in I suppose in this one's replay I will This is still going to be close, I've got a feeling this is still going to be close. That DeLorean is strangely fast. Or I am just strangely, no not strangely slow, let's admit it, not exactly that fast. Come on. We, we are going down towards the final corner here. Hey! Oh dear. I cannot be beaten by a DeLorean. This, this is not on. I am going to be beaten by a DeLorean again. No, 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 no. That was close. That was close. Um, screenshot could be a DeLorean. I think 0.7 of a second I think I was just too I was too oh okay for a clean race you get more prize money I understand now that I could do um again go right to the end last few seconds of the race here we go Beaten by a DeLorean. 
Obviously in this one I wasn't actually beaten by a DeLorean, but right there. And I think um The way I'm going to have to do this is going to be interesting because I think no no no. Let's go back and I'm going to have to take that car. Seriously? That's a great Easter egg. E Brown. That is that is brilliant. Oh who whoever well done Gran Turismo, whoever came up with that. That was, that's fantastic. That is absolutely fantastic. Well done. Right, and then do that. Just take a, a nice shot here. DeLorean, a little bit closer. I think I need to be, a, I'd like to be just a little. There we go. That's more like it. Turn that tilt back a bit because otherwise it looks a bit ridiculous. Do that. The glare on the bare metal is crazy. Let's take that shot. And then, as I said, one more, one more quick run, and that will be the Camaros done. That's that's clever, E Brown. That's really, really clever. Yes, so I didn't even notice that the first time. Right, so that's that gold. Or golded, golded, yeah, golded, gold. One more to go. Daytona. Uh, oh, that looks really difficult. This looks like a night race, and it is around the actual oval, so... Uh, yeah, this, this, could be, this could be interesting. Because my car really is not that fast. So... I'm thinking, I'm thinking, let's, and I'm only on sports tyres, let's give, let's give us a really nice top speed. There we go. That should do the trick. That should be there. This should be easy now. That's not an American car. I'm sorry, but that's not an American car. That's a British car. That's a Ford Focus RS. Ooh. What is that plane? Is that plane just taken off? The red lights on it are a bit crazy. Also, seriously. Um, the speed of this car around these corners is absolutely, utterly insane. Yep, I had to do that. That's me in third place. 175 miles per hour. Am I closing to... No, I, I do not think I'm closing. I need to... Uh, oh. Yep, this, this car just does not stick on the rear for some reason. I'm, I'll be honest, I'm not... I'm not particularly impressed with the... with the actual... Um, with the actual... Physics of the rear of the car, it feels like they've they've just I don't know. It it just does not feel right. It's still not the fastest. Second place has got the fastest lap. I like the fireworks. I like the fireworks. I am closing on second place, that's for sure. I'm not sure if I'm closing on first place, but I'm certainly closing on second place here. Even though they had the fastest lap. But 
Boogity, boogity, boogity. Let's go racing, boys. That was, that was fast. That was fast in that car. Um, that only took two minutes. Now that, I'll be honest, that could be an easy race for easy money. I actually think that could be one of the easier races. If I can win it, that is. I'm not sure if I could, if I can win it. But 13,000 every two and a half minutes, plus you go through a few things. So every three minutes or so, you, you get 13,000. That's that's pretty good. I do wonder if I could... I, I am wondering if I can go any faster. Should I try? I was four seconds off. A Camaro SS. Um, from the back of the grid. And if I, if I do this, I, I should have put racing tires on. Racing tires would have really helped me here. Um, I mean that, that could be even faster. Just curious here. But the, the racing tires would have really helped. But once I'm in fifth, I'm just leaving it in fifth, and hopefully it just sticks. The, the, the plan here is, I'm hoping the car just sticks the entire way through. There we go. Now that was a pretty, I think that was a pretty good move. That's me into already into third place. Now I've got to catch the top two. So that, this is where the extra speed should come in. Not sure about hanging on here. 180, 185, 187. This is not the speed you should be doing in a Mark 1. This is just not the speed you should be doing in a Mark 1. But let's see. Let's see if I can catch them two. They're still fighting up front. 188, 189, 190, 191. I mean, I guess slowing it down just by throwing it into the corner could work. But I feel like, I feel like I've not done a really good job here this time around. Whereas last time I did do a good job. They're still fighting. Come on, very, very close to losing it there. Slight bump on the wall, but no, no, I, I do not think I'm going to be capable of, of winning this. In fact, last time was better than this time, which is interesting given that this time I was going much, much faster. I guess they just had a much better, much better run overall. A 49 second lap. So is it 2.36 and then I was 4 seconds behind. This time it was a 2.29 and I was 6 seconds behind. So yeah, I guess we all just upped our pace. Yep, I think that, that is what happened. I think we all of us upped our pace. Interesting. Alright, well, with that, I guess I've got the Camaro, so it's time for me to end this particular video. Let's go back to the cafe, calf, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, like it tells you just there. And see what we got. I, I hit my 70,000 back. So essentially, I'm, I'm no richer, no poorer than I was uh, at this point. Oh, I didn't. I, I wanted to take that photo, but never mind. Thank you.
Yep. Okay, a two star ticket. I'll, I'll do that. And. Oh. No, I, I want. I want to. Come on. Oh, it's gone. Never mind. Take a photo of your car in scapes. Do you know what? I could probably do that before we end. What will it unlock? It unlocks Trial Mountain. Why? Why Why is it not? Yeah. Okay. Also, I'm just going to switch to a Camaro, just in case I decide to call this video something about chasing Camaros or something. So I'd just like to grab a Camaro, and particularly this Camaro. And I'd just like to put that in Scapes and, and do something. So over to Scapes we go. Let's grab one. Yeah, take your first photo. I, I know how to do this. Uh, which one do I want to do? Sure, let's just take the Great Ocean Road. Preparing photos. Done. Yeah, I, I, I know. I know how to do this. Oh, apparently... What, you can only pick the one car? Why not my car? Change selected car. I want my car on. There we go. That's more like it. Travel speed, yeah, let's be doing about 50 miles per hour. We've just slightly come around out of a corner. Let's do that. Let's have um, position lights on. 10 seconds can be off. That's fine. Probably want a, a, a little bit of dust on this. Nothing else like that. Some tire dirt. No tire damage. Some brake dust can be a little bit. Yeah, we've been playing a, along with this. And yeah, that looks fine. And to be, to be honest, I think... Um, oh, no, 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 I want to do that, and then how do I, I go to the camera, yes, 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 and I'll just, uh, you know what, I'll give them, I'll give them what they, they wanted at the start, so let's just render up that as the, the video they were, the, the picture they were asking for, which I'm not, I'll be honest, I'm not particularly keen on that, I would much rather have the 69 uh, display and the reason the reason for the 16.9 by the way is so that um, uh, the reason for the 16.9 is so that I can I can actually process wallpapers if I, if I want to and that's why I take 16.9 that I'm more keen on there we go um, save picture yes and we're done and that would be the end of this episode thank you very much for watching Please remember to hit the like button if you like this video, subscribe to the channel for more videos on Gran Turismo 7, leave a comment in the comments box below letting me know what you think. Don't forget to support me on Patreon, oh, uh, if you can do so at www.patreon.com slash ecgadget, your support would be massively appreciated, it would really, really help me out and also you can find me on social media at ecgadgets LP for both Twitter and Instagram. That is all from me. I guess next time I'm either going to be going to Trial Mountain or doing something slightly different. They also need to sort out the lighting on the on the helicopters. But oh boy, returning to Trial Mountain for racing. This is going to be interesting. I'll see you next time. <laughs>